Hi everyone, uh, this is Tamir again and uh, what I'd like to do is uh, show you a few little updates that I made to the uh, Render Material Assigner script. If you uh, remember, then uh, this little script um, actually uh, distributes um, materials to each and every face on the mesh or at least that's what it used to do. It still does that if you want but there are actually two new options in the panel that you can see here through the material distribution method. This is a uh, new uh, little feature here uh, which en enables you to choose between three different uh, possibilities, three uh, different uh, methods for distributing um, materials. The face is the usual one so each face gets a random color as you can see here but there is also two new ones, new uh, features. First is the vertex group which means that every vertex group here will get a material all its own. Um, you can see that this little cube here has um, six uh, vertex groups. If I'll go to edit mode you can see them. Uh, I'll just select each one so you have one, two, three, and you know the rest of them. Four, and you have the top and bottom, and then there's the last one which is actually just the rest. So, um, now that we have this one, if we uh, choose vertex group, you can see that it's assigning a random material to each group. So that's pretty nice, isn't it? <laughs> But the latest trick uh, that I added is actually signing um, according to loose parts. So how does this work? Actually I'm going to have to have some loose parts here to demonstrate this. So I'm just going to add a little array uh, modifier here. I'm going to increase the offset and just add a few more objects. And uh, now I'm going to apply the modifier so we actually have one big mesh that has um, all these little cubes here so now when we have the loose part selected you can actually distribute a material per every loose part every little mesh island gets its own material so that's even nicer I guess this could be useful for you know um, domino cubes just like this one or many other things like uh, slight variations of materials between rocks or uh, I don't know fence uh, objects or even um, maybe bricks if you want to use a full a whole object for each brick so this is pretty nice um, that's about it so you can just uh, install and download it um, same way and I'll uh, add a little download link uh, that would enable you to uh, get the latest script it's now on github and I hope you uh, enjoy this little script so have a good day